Dear brothers and sisters in Christ, today we enter Holy Week and Christ enters Jerusalem and enters into his passion. Each year on the Sunday before Easter, Christians around the world celebrate and commemorate what is traditionally called Palm or Passion Sunday when we recount the events leading up to the betrayal, crucifixion and death of our Lord and Saviour Jesus Christ. This week is the high point of the liturgical year culminating in the celebration of the Lord's Resurrection next Sunday. This is thought of as the busiest but also the richest week in the Christian calendar. The Sunday liturgy of the Eucharist on Palm Sunday begins with a reenactment of the triumphant entry of Jesus into Jerusalem. Due to COVID, we are not able to have any possession as we normally do. We hear the recounting of this event in the Gospel. All that we celebrate throughout Holy Week is a clear reminder that God is with us now working on our behalf and that the power of the resurrection of Christ has a daily and real effect in our lives. We are to be convinced the working of the Holy Spirit in us and with us is an undying source of grace and now and always. Saint Benedict tells his monks, your way of acting should be different from the world's ways. That means every follower of Christ, not just monks, is in need of evaluating the use of time, talents, words, thoughts and deeds. We not only evaluate though, but also change what needs to be changed in order to reflect and live out a Christian commitment here and now. This is no easy task and we may fail regularly in our attempts, but we never give up trying. May this Holy Week find us renewed in the love of God and neighbor, eager to celebrate next Sunday the Passover of our Lord, the central mystery of our Christian faith, the resurrection of Christ. We are called to die with Christ so that we might rise with him as well. May God illumine and guide our steps today and throughout our lives. A blessed Holy Week to you all.